Evening YouTube, sidekick here in my trusty A4 Skyhawk. Uh, actually flying the third sortie of the day. This one was kind of unplanned. You can see we got some cluster bomb units on board. Uh, we're looking at a target of opportunity, a convoy that's actually uh, stranded by one of the bridges we took out earlier in the day. Uh, I'll give you the whole uh, situation in just a sec. Let me get the cockpit set up. We need bombs. We want to drop them all. Yeah, let's try and space them out a good long distance apart and do ripple single. That looks like it'll work. Uh, we also have to deflect the gun sight way down because uh, we're dropping the CBUs. Okay, that looks good. So the situation is this. You'll remember that uh, earlier today we were uh, up at the harbor in the north and then uh, later on we took out a couple of bridges that we hoped would keep the enemy from moving more air defense uh, assets up to the harbor uh, here let me uh, throw up a map maybe this will help uh, you remember so the harbor's up in the top left and the bridges are in the middle anyways the recce guys went out to take a look uh, and do a bomb damage assessment on the bridges and lo and behold they discovered that it looks like there was a convoy that didn't get the word that the bridge was out uh, and now it's kind of stuck up against the bridge and uh, trying to figure out what to do. It's basically in that wooded area uh, near the bridge in South Bridge, and it runs all the way back towards that triangular piece of open ground. So uh, normally wouldn't be too thrilled about going back and doing another low-level pass on the target that we'd already uh, attacked today, uh, especially since that convoy probably has some some AAA in it, but we figure it's the end of the day, and if we attack it from the far end of the valley, the sun will be in their eyes. Uh, and since uh, you know we were the ones who took out the bridges, command asked us to take the mission to go out and see what we can do about this convoy. So we're going to fly in along the ridge. We're going to look over to the right and see if we can pick up the convoy, make sure it's there. Uh, so there's that triangular patch of woods. Yeah, yeah, I definitely think I see some trucks there. Well, and the bridges that we got. Uh, okay, let's take another quick look over the side. Look back. Yeah, oh no, yeah, there's definitely trucks at this end of the woods too. All right, that's a pretty juicy target. Okay, so we're going to go down the end of the ridge here. We're going to pull back into the valley. We're going to go low. Uh, hopefully we'll get the low altitude warning system to go off. That'll tell us we're down uh, around 500 feet, which is where we want to be for dropping these CBUs. Okay, we're pulling in, pulling in, pulling in. Now we got to get it lined up. Get it lined up. Get it lined up. Okay, I think that's good. That's good. All right, here we go. Here we go. And there it is. Pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Keep dropping. That's looking pretty good. Okay, well, the CBUs are impressive. Let's see if we got any secondary explosions down there. Let's take a look. Ooh, yes, sir. We have a. Ooh, look at that. There was a little bit of AAA in that convoy. A little bit uh, too little too late, though. All right, so let's take a look. We still got things cooking off down there. Looks like that whole road is covered in burning vehicles right now. Oops, yeah, they're still cooking off. Okay, let's just uh, go around here quickly, get a look from the far end. Okay, let's take a look. Well, that's a site to warm the cockles uh, of any bomb damage assessor's heart. Let's take a quick count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think I count nine burning vehicles. Uh, that is an excellent result. Okay, looks like our work here is done. Just uh, time to head home. Just a reminder that if you are enjoying these A4 videos, don't forget to like and subscribe, and hey, 
put that bell on too. This is Sidekick, signing off.